right, I'm going to go ahead and do a video upload on these guys, uh, Angela, John Gage, uh, and Andrew Anglin. If you haven't listened to this video upload called Deutschland, I suggest that you do if you want a great laugh, okay? Angela John Gage works with several other people on the internet. And what he does is basically leads people to go to other websites. Whatever information you find inside of his index is always a lead to somewhere else. Notice this image right here it looks photoshopped. Okay, so you have this person probably standing at about five feet tall. He's got little tiny uniforms in the background and he is looking disproportionate. Okay, disproportioned. <laughs> Andrew Anglin has his license available all over the internet. If you look at his license, he is standing at about five feet two inches tall. These people belong to a tribe who are very short in height. Okay, let's listen to this guy. I'm 29. Um, and was something of a, of a casualty of the, the education system and, and the culture and everything else in America. So um, I, 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 I had it in my mind in my, my teenage years that I wanted to understand the world, understand what was going on. Um, and so <laughs> All right, so um, this guy works with William Fink, Mike Delaney, Scott Roberts, Alan Martinson Jr. John Allen Martinson Jr. I can't remember his name. Shiksa Goddess. Angela John Gage. William Fink, and several other people who claim that they are Caucasian, okay? Now these people are comedy. Anytime you listen to these people, you will get a good laugh. Aye, aye, aye. But I think the funniest person out of all of these people would be this guy right here, Angelo John Gage. Angelo just uploaded a video where he is basically pretending that he is Adolf Hitler. If you know anything about Adolf Hitler, Adolf Hitler actually caused the deaths of several Caucasian people, okay? And the reason being is obviously Adolf Hitler was not a Caucasian. When you look at the facial features of this person, as well as the height of this person, this person is actually related to Angela John Gage, which is basically why, in my opinion, Angela wants to be Adolf Hitler. Angela wants to be Adolf Hitler so very badly that he has been spending his days practicing on how to sound exactly like Adolf Hitler. So let's listen. Es macht mich wütend zu sehen, in welche Zeitlichen Lage er euch heute befindet. You know who sold me this house? A Hasidic Jew. Literally, with the hat and the curl and, and the glasses and the, the suit. Hey, how are you? 
Peter's son, I'm also mentioned. So, uh, yeah, are you going to have any kids? Are you married yet? Are you going to have five or six kids? It's spricht der Führer. You dumb guy, you shouldn't have any kids on. You don't go like this and tell you to check it. I got seven Mac 11s, about eight, 38, 9, 9, 10 Mac 10s to set number in. You can't touch my riches. So while Angelo's busy being mommy at home with his little baby, while his baby's sleeping, this person has been practicing his German so that he could sound exactly like his hero. You dumb guy, you shouldn't have any kids. Okay, and like I said, the reason why this person wants to sound exactly like his hero is because his hero is biologically related to Angelo. And just so you know, the printer has been purchased, and in fact, it's in Nathan's room right now. Here's a picture of the printer. Okay, it's a very big printer. It's not a printer. Nathan has to set this all up and he's going to make a video very soon for all of you guys. Never in a million years did I imagine I'd be sitting in a cell, you know. Now, I'm just making this video because I also raised funds for the printer, so I'm also responsible for an armed robbery charge. To tell those who put money into the funds or the fundraiser. Es mag mich mutten zu sehen, in welcher Zeit liegen Laden in euch heute befinden. I'm not the spokesman of his organization. Hey everyone, uh, I'm in uh, California. I'm not gonna tell you exactly where, but I'm with my second in command, Nathan. Es macht mich guten zu sehen, in welcher Zeit liegen Laden in euch heute befinden. It's like they put him through a paper shredder. They took him when he was 18 and put him through a paper shredder and then sent him back to us. We get to put try and put all the pieces back together and so i had to say nathan i'd like to make this message for every one of my youtube people because again there's people out there running around screaming it's stolen money and we're a scam and all this other crap and for those idiots there goes your credibility out the window, as we said it would. And for everyone else who had faith in us, thank you for the support. You want some of this, bitch? If you guys want to donate to my Have Children Foundation, I would be more than happy to take your donations because we could use the financial help and then I'll have some more kids. Bye. Bye. So I believe converting people is the most effective way to change this world. And that's really what it is because if you think about it, the Jewish communists converted everybody to communism and liberalism. You know who sold me this house? and save thousands of dollars because we spent about $300. Bye. Bye. It's spricht der Führer. Now Nathan can print flyers by the thousands at a fraction of a cost. The court finds that the base term as to count once for the second degree robbery shall be three years the court further finds that the firearm allegation having been pleaded and proven by the defendant's admission that three years is to be added to the base term to be served consecutively for a total of six years. It is therefore the judgment and sentence of this court that the defendant be imprisoned in the state prison for six years. He is remanded to the custody of the sheriff who is ordered to transport him to the reception center at the Richard J. Donovan Correctional Facility. You all right? Yeah, I just needed you over here for a second.
<laughs> I came running. I thought mom was, was yeah, I don't know, trapped or right. stuck under something. <laughs> This can happen to my son, it can happen to anybody out there. PTSD is a real thing. It's like they put the printer, paper shredder, printer, paper shredder. And in fact, it's in Nathan's room right now. Paper shredder. Here's a picture of the printer. Paper shredder. Okay, it's a very big printer. It's not a printer you just type in things and it happens. There's actually programs that go with it. You gotta learn how to use it. And through a paper shredder, they took him when he was 18 and put him. And so that's why this printer was necessary. I would recommend that anyone who has an account shut down, create a new one. If that gets shut down, create a new one. I know it gets tiring, but keep doing it. Doing it. Doing it. Uh, Twitter only has a certain amount of resources and it will drain their resources if we keep setting up more and more um, uh, uh, you know, accounts over and over again. If it gets to the point where you can no longer uh, use an account under your own name, then uh, set up one under under a fake name. <laughs> this cuck server. You dumb guy. You shouldn't have any kids. On. <laughs> this cuck server. You dumb guy. You shouldn't have any kids. On. <laughs> this cuck server. You dumb guy. You shouldn't have any kids. On. You're an idiot. <laughs>